Hi, I'm Chief Meteorologist Tony Petraka in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the uh, Weather Now link with a uh, mid-evening update. It's about uh, 9 o'clock in the evening. Uh, showers that we had today have uh, cleared the coastline. We've had a nice evening in progress with the gradual clearing. We head outside as of the uh, 9 o'clock hour down uh, in Newport. And you can see that uh, yeah, the skies are partly cloudy. And we're looking at uh, dry conditions as well. We do expect the humidity to be dropping off uh, overnight through uh, early on Saturday morning. High temps today, a little cool for this time of year. Actually, the first day of summer. Today is the summer solstice. We made it to uh, the lower 70s. We're thinking upper 70s, briefly near 80 tomorrow afternoon, so it's a, well, a milder day. So things that we're watching, well, for one, that lower humidity working in tonight, the, uh, the winds will be picking up out of the northwest, bringing in some of that drier air. Uh, as far as um, the weekend, we're going to go decent Saturday, better Sunday. So what do we mean by decent? Well, first of all, Saturday by no means is a stormy day or a washout. However, uh, with a mix of clouds and sunshine, we'll have to watch for a brief isolated shower or thunderstorm during the afternoon, somewhere between roughly uh, 2 and 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Now, it's brief and it's isolated, and for the most part, it's, it's still a mainly dry day, and we'll talk more about Saturday in just a second. Sunday's beautiful. We've got uh, lots of sunshine, dry, and uh, warmer, too, with uh, temperatures in the at least the lower 80s, perhaps not as gusty uh, the wind as what we'll see on, on Saturday. Here's a satellite and radar composite, and you can see uh, some of the precipitation that we had today is now edging offshore. Uh, east of Cape Cod. We've seen some uh, clearing skies and uh, we'll widen out the view and through upstate New York um, drier air coming in. In fact, um, you know, temperatures tonight with that drier air should drop down into the upper 50s to lower 60s. A big thunderstorm complex, uh, what we call an MCC, Mesoscale Convective Complex. <laughs> Kind of fancy terminology for a big organized area of thunderstorms. This is going to stay to our south. So we are mainly dry for the weekend with a little bump of the road, as mentioned, for a portion of Saturday afternoon. Now, there is drier air, lower humidity uh, in southeastern Canada through the Great Lakes, northern New England, and that will be dropping down through early Saturday morning, so a comfortable feel uh, to the air. Let's walk you through um, Saturday afternoon. Now, Saturday morning looks dry, lots of sunshine. What we'll notice on, on Saturday afternoon, a couple of things. We'll go from mostly sunny to kind of a cumulus cloud sunshine mix, kind of a look like this. Now, there's the chance for uh, an isolated shower or a thunderstorm really at all locations. So I, I do think the highest chance would be in the areas shaded in yellow, essentially in southeastern Massachusetts. Now, with that said, um, it doesn't necessarily mean that we've got a, a washout on the way. For one, these uh, showers or isolated thunderstorms are just that. They're random. They're isolated. Not every town will get one. And they're rather short duration in any given location, all of about maybe 15 minutes, and then the sun comes back out. So when you average out the entire day, it's mainly dry. But just be mindful. If you've got outdoor activities, you're on the golf course or something like that, you may get sidetracked briefly. And your Saturday evening, Saturday night looks fine. Let me show you the temperature breakdown. Overnight, we'll drop to the uh, lower 60s. Here we are at 10 o'clock in the morning. It's already in the uh, mid-70s, and we're looking at, you know, about 75 to 80 by uh, 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And then we'll settle back into uh, the upper 60s to lower 70s by just before sunset on Saturday. So Saturday morning, it is um, it's a mainly sunny start, dry, breezy. Uh, temperatures starting off in the upstate to uh, lower 70s. And then during the afternoon, that cloud-sun mixture, about 75 to 80. And again, we'll watch for that isolated brief uh, shower or uh, thunderstorm. Who's going to hit the pool this weekend? Right, first full weekend of summer. And um, again, looking at that quick afternoon shower on Saturday, you may have to just kind of go into the umbrella for a little bit. But then, again, it won't last long. Uh, Sunday, uh, even nicer. It's uh, sunny and it's warmer. Looking at uh, temperatures, it'll be in the uh, the lower 80s for afternoon high, somewhere between 80 and 85. All right, beaches for Saturday. Uh, for the most part, sunny and breezy. I think that may be the only downside at the beach. It'll be kind of a gusty breeze, but otherwise sunny. I'll just keep an eye to the sky. Very uh, late afternoon or early evening for a passing shower. Air temperature 75, water temp at 60. Definitely need the sunscreen. And uh, more so on Sunday, too, with a good deal of sunshine 
at the beaches on Sunday. Uh, boaters, you've got a gusty wind. Um, as of now, um, no small crap advisory has been issued. You may need one, though. Uh, northwest at uh, 15 to 25 knots. Visibility unlimited, but when we if we get that passing shower or thunderstorm, obviously the visibility goes down briefly. Waves of about one to two feet. And the other thing, boaters, especially if you're going to be out on the bay mid to late afternoon, be mindful that you know some of these showers could actually be uh, a few isolated thunderstorms. So keep an eye to the sky. You see the sky getting dark. Potential is there for thunder. And again, isolated and brief wouldn't last long in any given location, but uh, be on the lookout for at least a small chance of lightning. Uh, Sunday's nice, uh, sunshine, a little warmer, temperatures in the um, in the lower 80s. Uh, Monday is uh, looking good as well. More sunshine somewhere between 80 and 85. CVS Charity uh, Golf Classic this weekend, uh, Sunday and Monday. And uh, both days are looking good for golf. Next chance for any uh, scattered showers uh, would return on Tuesday. A little cooler, humid, with uh, temps in the upper 70s. So I would say like 80 to 90 percent of the weekend as a whole that entire 48 hour period saturday and sunday 80 to 90 percent of it is rain free and dry just that little bump and that little hiccup in the mid to late afternoon on saturday and again the key words here isolated and brief uh, but that chance is there um, coming up shortly i'll have the uh, another update on our 10 o'clock news on fox providence again at 11 o'clock on wpri and do check with pete mangione early in the morning on saturday starting at 6 a.m with your updated forecast that's your latest Weather Now update. Thanks for logging in, and we'll talk to you soon.